What's up, guys? This is Brian J's Nerd Talk, and this is my review of The Three Body Problem, Episode 6. And this is probably the worst episode of the season. Nothing really happened. Um, there was a lot of dialogue that was not that great. It felt like things were just kind of being dragged out because they did eight episodes. And it's like, we got to have this episode that's like a filler episode. But there was some character development and progression where one of the characters is in love with this woman. He's... Uh, afraid to confess his love to her um, because he's afraid of being rejected and he's about to die because he has cancer that's like really advanced and so he's gonna die but he is a millionaire because his friend who was killed gave him half of his estate which is about 20 million pounds which I guess for US currency is like 32 million dollars 30 or 32 million dollars no uh, 20 million pounds I guess translate. Yeah, it would be like maybe $32 million in American currency. But um, anyways, so at the end of this episode, this is spoilers, by the way. At the end of this episode, he decides to buy a star for the woman that he's in love with, which this episode, in fact, I think these next two episodes, they're adapting stuff from book three because they've mostly adapted the first book. That's mostly adapted. But now they're they're kind of skipping over stuff in the second book and they're adapting uh the first part the first 100 pages of this book uh death's end by zijin lu uh this is the third book and so they're adapting uh the first part of the third book for episode six um seven and eight i think uh let's see what's it's what's this part called uh the first part of the book uh that's that's the eras part one is called uh yeah it's part one and it's the beginning of let's see it's in the crisis era year one uh let's see yeah it's about this guy who is in love with a woman, I think her name is a Yang Dung, and he never confesses his love to her. They went to university together. They went to the same university, um, I think the same university in China, and yeah, they. he is in love with her, and he is dying of some sort of illness, Of and he gets like $3 million from his rich friend, who was like really successful. It took an idea and he made like millions of dollars off of it. And so he gives him like uh, $3 million uh, uh, of the the business of what he did that was really, really successful. He made some sort of like drink and product and it came from his friend's idea and he became like a millionaire and he decided to give him $3 million. But the guy who gets the 3 million, he's like dying of cancer. It's really advanced. Just like this character in Three Body Problem, it's like a pancreatic cancer. It's really advanced. It's all over his body. He's going to die. So he decided to buy a star for a woman he loved. And the woman he loved uh, saw his name and found out that he was going to die. And so they take, they're going to take his brain, put it into a rocket ship, and try to fly it out into outer space to act like a probe for the aliens. And so the humans will know, the human race will know how the, tri the Trizalorans uh, actually think, uh, uh, in the far future, the aliens. And so, which they give a different name in this show for some reason. They don't give them the name Trizzle Lawrence in the show. Like they, like that's their name in the book. They give them a different name in Chinese, which means three body. Uh, okay. I mean, that's, I, that's, a, I, that's an okay change, I guess. But yeah, they're, these last three episodes are basically adapting the first like 100 something pages of, book three which i think is very very interesting let's see here uh, yeah the first 99 pages yeah they're adapting the first 99 pages and i guess they're putting him into the last three episodes of season one i find that very interesting i'm very surprised by that but i'm glad i read a good portion of book three i read the first 99 pages of book three and uh i'm on to the second part of book three but I'm glad I read that now because I'm very much familiar with all this that's going on. And I find that kind of interesting. But in this episode, not other than him buying a star and him having cancer, them <clears throat> wanting to use a human who we know is going to be too much mass. They're going to use a human brain, which is his brain. Uh, 
I, I know where it's going, and I felt like episode six was just filler. There was just like a lot of scenes where not a whole lot was going on. It was a lot of empty scenes, and there just wasn't a lot of activity and things were just kind of going through the motions, and they just put this episode here to reach the the whole eight episodes. So, yeah, I think this is the worst episode. I would give it like a, a five out of ten. I give it a five out of ten. I think this is the worst episode so far. But on to the last two episodes, and I'll let you know what I think uh, with the last two episodes. And uh, this is Brian J's Nerd Talk. This is my review of season one, episode six. I'll talk to you all later. Peace.